well shalom uh, this video I was just walking and the Lord was reminding me about the fact that he is the narrow gate and few there be that find that narrow gate and once you enter that narrow gate then um, straight is the path that, that the man has to walk um, to attain his salvation at the end he's, he's, he's given it as a free gift in the beginning but just as every free gift that we're given we have responsibility to use that that gift correctly and uh, I was just reminded of that today and uh, well of all the things that are going on in the world today which I've made some videos um, exposing the many many um, agents CIA MI6 many different agents on YouTube uh, and on the internet disinformation um, especially about chemtrails the, the official government story is that it's uh, freezing water um, and it's not a chemtrail it's an actual contrail but uh, that's scientifically um, disproven and there's countless um, countless video evidence showing that uh, indeed they are using uh, chemicals, spraying chemicals, aerosols into the air and this is in the name of uh, geoengineering and it's causing severe fluctuation in temperatures all around the world and also is poisoning the water and the ground and uh, some now predict that it's very much um, linked you know these weather weapons are actually linked to the book of revelation where it talks about wormwood and uh, making the waters bitter um, that in fact is one and the same but that's not to say that, that a, a real large meteor will strike the earth very soon uh, as, as I was shown in a vision over 10 years ago now 11 years ago so um, basically um, I, I saw that it was due to happen but I wasn't given a date but I did pray about it and I was shown that it was linked to certain um, meteor activity and uh, so that's why I'm always sort of keeping track about looking out for if anybody mentions a two times three kilometer size um, meteor and it's confirmed by major sources and even minor sources then I think that would be for me that would be the one uh, that I saw in my vision it is very sick when even cartoons go to the extreme about uh, including these uh, chemtrails, these white streaks or coloured streaks in the sky. That's basically called uh, mind control for children. And uh, as I said before, um, many mind control agents on YouTube today and uh, certainly they're preaching their own false gospel uh, that's for that's for certain as I saw in a vision the other week there is definitely what's called the black sun or it's a massive um, um, black hole and m various moons and planets out there um, but we see that most of that uh, is a cover-up for the fact there's more activity going on in the planet Saturn than we're actually led to believe um, many people now are just uncovering the um, large spacecraft around the planet Saturn on, and the rings of Saturn there's been many good videos done about that um, the Cassini craft went up about 2006 and actually and recorded uh, these very things and uh, we see in the Mes Mes Mesopotamian tablets uh, stands for Saturn and the giants that came from Saturn um, also um, well I have mentioned them before but uh, Let's just um, mention a little bit more about the cult of Saturn on this earth. It is very much known that the cult of Saturn are a pagan cult. And uh, they are actually known for kidnapping and raping and killing and eating uh, children. And uh, it's very uh, well documented in the news today that uh, Pope Ratzinger and uh, various people from the British royal family and Dutch royal family and so on in fact there's a, a large, a huge list of, of people 
that apparently are involved in this cult of Saturn, which is very much uh, the main Luciferic um, cult on this planet, which does refer to, of course, the uh, pretty much worship the planet Saturn, and the six-pointed star is listed in the scriptures as the star of Chun or Ramphant, which again is the same thing uh, as mentioned in the, uh, the book of Exodus, and uh, it's mentioned again in the book of Acts, that the apostles um, rebuked, of course, uh, many of the um, Pharisees that they knew about this, that were probably involved in uh, satanic activities, but that's not to say all of them were just, just as the churches and the priesthoods today, that some of them are not um, involved in this cult of Saturn, but eventually that some of them might be led into it. And it's these very people that, uh, when they discover these things, some of them come out and uh, expose what's actually happening uh, in the likes of the Vatican. Uh, many eyewitnesses and people saying that there's very many satanic rituals going on in that vicinity and uh, today. So let's just pray uh, for any, any victims of these uh, families that have been involved uh, in these uh, terrible horrific things and pray that uh, the people involved in this will be swiftly brought to justice. And I'd just like to add, of course, that uh, there, there is another cult uh, called the Raelians, and it's very strange that uh, Barack Obama is so, so very much like um, one of the Egyptian pharaohs. It's very, very strange that he's, he's almost identical um, to one of the last Egyptian pharaohs who, who brought in uh, sun worship, of course, but uh, basically... Uh, it's very well documented and um, basically um, it's also seen recently that there's a there's a man living in Indonesia that could very well be his true father but let's just say that um, he could have been engineered he could have been cloned um, as there seems to be quite a number of um, Obama's half-brothers and so on that uh, do look like this man and I uh, wouldn't be surprised if there was some kind of cloning program going on. And uh, remember the, the Queen at the Olympics, many thought that it wasn't actually the Queen that attended the Olympics, that it, it could have been a clone or a lookalike. Remember Adolf Hitler and Stalin and even Saddam Hussein had many lookalikes. So it's, it's, not a, it's a very common thing among the elites to have uh, lookalikes. So again, um, let's pray for justice. But uh, at the same time, just just be aware that uh, if any of these people go in and are arrested, then let's pray it is the right um, ones that they get, not not the clones. Thanks for listening.